only five teams in each conference failed to make even the play-in tournament, and the LeBron-led Lakers were one of them. So what happens now? Our Brian Windhorst says LeBron and Lakers owner Jeannie Buss are in a good place, and that LeBron wants to be in L.A. Surprise, surprise. The two sides have a big decision on a contract extension in August. Pat, you have said recently if you could play with any superstar in the league, it'd be LeBron. Still at this age, right? Would you want to play with LeBron on these Lakers? If I was a free agent? Yes. Uh, and if me and Minnesota didn't agree to yeah, a number? Yeah, correct. Yes. You would? Not even, I wouldn't even hesitate. Um, just to be able to play with a great like that, be able to pick his brain, um, be able to, you know, be a star in, the, in, in, in whatever role that I have, playing aside Russell Westbrook, Fantastic. I mean, I, we couldn't ask for and plan for the Lakers. Couldn't ask for a better job. So it se- it sounds to me from from a lot of your commentary today, and I, we were talking on the radio earlier, the kind of athlete eyeball test. You think some guys' reputations are over what the re- what the players in the league think, and some guys are the real McCoy. And obviously, LeBron fits into that category yeah. as great and greater than people even understand. He get, and he get, he keeps getting better. You know, we can we can look at all these guys, these superstar guys who, oh, they decline, they decline, not him. He's gotten better. Boy's like wine. It's crazy. But what about the supporting cast? Or do you think you would help that? I, I help everyone, don't I? <laughs> I mean, I, these, I, I don't lie. Uh, this is true. I help everyone I play with. Yeah, well, it, Key talked about it on KJM in the morning this morning, JJ, like, and everyone says about Patrick Beverly. Boy, you hate him when he's playing against your team. But damn, I'd love to have him on my team. You want guys like Pat in your locker room. JJ, like not to mention on the floor, right? Mm-hmm. JJ, do the Lakers need to do anything to sell LeBron, do you think, on L.A.? No, I, I, no. Look, he went there. They had a treasure trove of young players and assets. They put them all on the table to get Anthony Davis, and they won a championship. Like, his tenure. Bubble championship. Okay. Or, okay. There's, uh, if you want to do the, if you want to do this exercise, we can go year by year, and I can put an asterisk next to a lot of championships. I just said bubble. Pat, am I lying? I don't want am to, I lying? You, you am think, I lying? One thing about you, you, you do lie. No, you could put an asterisk to a lot of championships. Some. Okay. Are you want to go by year by year? Go last year. Last year, okay. There was a bunch of injuries. The Suns probably wouldn't That's have been true. in the finals. Kawhi, if Kawhi Leonard doesn't yeah, tear his knee. There's no fans. Milwaukee might not have beat Brooklyn. That's My, true. Milwaukee might not have he beat Brooklyn. Kicked Joe Lewis's hey, 2019. Uh, Pat. Do the Raptors win if Kevin Durant There's doesn't no tear his fans. Achilles? Hey, I don't know. What about our fans? Some of the best fans in the world. Some of the best fans in the world. You think Milwaukee is walking into Boston in the bubble? You think the Milwaukee Brooklyn Nets the are up, losing man. without Kyrie and James Harden? If they had Kyrie and James Harden, does Milwaukee get out of that round? Hey, man, James Harden plays the Philadelphia 76ers. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm, going back, I'm going back to the – all right, listen. Pat, outside of LeBron, what are the reasons that players should want to come to the – go to the Lakers, play for the Lakers, do you think? Um, I think, uh, obviously, L.A. Yeah. Um, but that's pretty much it. You know, um, it's a lot of pressure playing for the Lakers. And we've seen this with Russell Westbrook. It's a lot of pressure playing. Everything you do will be dissected to the tedious, the smallest amount. You know, you're talking about America's team. You know, it seems to me like Westbrook, it's like surprising what it does to some players, and especially if you're from there, I'm sure. But Lakers aren't for everyone. You have to be built a certain way. Like Kobe would even talk about that. But it would seem to me like they are for Russell Westbrook. But it didn't turn out that way. J.J., who do you think are the best coaching candidates for the job to be well, head coach of the Lakers? Look, I... On the Russell point, I'll, I'll say this because I've said this numerous times this year. The Lakers got who they traded for. There's nothing about Russell's play this year that I thought, oh, he's a different player than who he has been. No shooting around him. The decline in production is, an, is attributed to me in terms of the fit. They didn't have shooting. There was no spacing. You're talking about a ball-dominant guy playing with a ball-dominant guy and LeBron James. I'm not sure what the expectation was there for Russ that he was going to be who he was and average a triple-double on that team. I I, I don't think that was realistic. In terms of the coaching candidates, look, I I think Mark Jackson deserves another shot. I think Mark Jackson deserves another shot. And I don't know if that's who they've targeted, who's number one on their list. You know, there's tons of rumors about (laughs) Doc Rivers and and maybe leaving Philly and getting to the Lakers. But as of right now, for who's a real candidate, I like Mark Jackson. In every sport, you get certain guys who have a reputation. Oh, he can get you to a certain place. Then you have to bring in someone to get you. But a lot of times, the guy who gets you to a certain place never gets a chance to show, no, I can get you over the top, too, especially having learned from your first experience. Mark Jackson, Dan Tony, Kenny Atkinson. Dan Tony for the Lakers? And Kenny Atkinson. With this crew for Dan Tony? 
You think D'Antoni wants that stress in his life? You know he's like 75 years old. That's my dog. I love him to death. But <laughs> he's he can, great. Hey, he can do the job. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.